now in the gcp console i'm selecting my project to be the lab and here i'm going to select kubernetes engine and i'm going to create a cluster of standard mode now i should give the name okay so i'm just leaving these things i'm using static version okay create so this will take some time so i will resume the video after it is done so the cluster is created now now let us launch the google cloud console here so now let us connect our console to interact with our cluster so for that i'm using g cloud container clusters get credentials the cluster name which is user wishlist cluster and then i will give the zone and the project which is nothing but this okay so the zone is your central one and the project is this okay all right it is connected now then let us check the version of kubectl connected to this okay and then let us check if helm is already there it is there so we need helm to uh, get the ingress for our project right so let us set up engines ingress with the help of helm so i'm going to add that repo so it says it already exists because we have used it previously right so i would highly recommend you to go through the previous project series where we have uh, explained detail about this now i'm going to install the engines with my release okay so to set up this it might take some time i'm pausing the video till then so it's done right now okay we can also watch the status by running this one okay so let us check it so it says external ip is pending so it is still setting up okay so no problem meanwhile let us uh, get our sorry clear meanwhile let us get our uh, github repo so this is the github repo i will clone it using this link git clone okay so ls now cd to this uh, repository ls so these are the things right so let us uh, apply all the configurations uh, configuration yaml files inside this kates so that it will create all the kubernetes resources like services deployments and all okay but before that we should also create the secret right because based on the secret only the web service uh, web deployment and postgres deployment are based because they are using the uh, this password to access the database right so the command is kubectl create secret generic pass uh, generic pg password so be careful with the spellings from literal pg password is hello flask okay 
so let us get the kubectl get secrets so this is there right this pg password okay now we just need to apply all the configurations of gates folder this gates folder okay so we can do that in a single go using kubectl apply minus f k8 so it seems everything is created right so let us check if everything is created one by one so let us see kubectl get pods so it is creating some uh, so the postgres is getting created redis is already running and web deployment is getting created right so again i'll clear the screen let us check the pods again so now everything is running okay so this is the ingress controller right and these are the other pods now let us also check the services kubectl get services okay all the services are up and then kubectl get pvc this is the persistent volume claim so this is the volume which is which is bound to that and all and then kubectl get ingress okay so now let us check it here under services and ingress so all these are services and then ingress so this ingress is still getting created and once it's ready okay so now copy this link go to incognito mode paste it here okay so we are able to access our application right so let us check keys first there is nothing because we haven't yet started using our app on cloud till now so let us create some entries save so it says successfully saved right now let us check the keys we should ideally see this because we have saved it now okay now let if i do it here i should get the message from uh, i should get the message that the details are fetched from redis okay now again if i create uh, some details with the similar username same username it throws a message telling it exists already right so uh, we have successfully deployed our multi container application on kubernetes engine of gcp okay